Assalamu alaikum students, welcome back to your global public school online classes. This is the fourth video of your extension, the extension of British rule in India. Initially we, initially we studied about how the British extended their empire in India uh, from the Bengal, from the Marathas and how they extended their complete uh, empire through the three Anglo-Maratha wars. We studied that in the earlier classes and also we studied about the two important cunning policies of the British that is the doctrine of lapse policy and also the subsidiary alliance policy. So in this class we, guys, we are going to study the two more wars of the British and also of the Indian kings that is the Anglo-Sikh wars which was happened and there was another three wars that is Anglo Mysore wars that you will study in the next lesson that is the impact of British rule in Karnataka but for now in this class we are going to study Anglo Sikh wars in detail so let's see what is the reason why this war happened when exactly it happened so the first reason behind the Anglo Sikh wars here is a political anarchy broke out in Punjab after the death of King Ranjit Singh in 1839. When the King Ranjit Singh died, many people started telling that we want to become king of that in their relatives only. So uh, political anarchy was broke out in Punjab. That was the first reason. And the second reason behind this is the British attempted to invade the Punjab violating the continuous friendship pact. Though they were a good friends of uh, British they were again still try to harm that by invading by uh, violating that and they had with the nearest kings that is a one more reason in December 1845 a war actually broke out here in between the British and Punjab what happens here see in the picture students sensing the danger from an outside force not only six hindus muslims all the people came together to defeat with the british see here a kind of love and friendship which the another other religions also had towards the six students here finally they had to accept the defeat due to the few traitor leaders students you understand everywhere like what happened to the Sirajud Dola in the Battle of Plassey. The military leader of his own military leader, leader actually became a traitor. He actually cheated him. Traitors means uh, cheaters. So here also the lot of cheaters were there because of which they had to accept the defeat due to the few cheater leaders effects the six are losers in battle they had signed a humiliating Lahore agreement in the 1846 and with the British resident became the de facto ruler of Punjab so what happened in this war see students the first thing is six became I mean the six became the losers in the battle and second thing they came under the agreement that's the Lahore agreement and the British resident became the de facto ruler of Punjab and like this Punjab became the dependent state of East India Company a very bad effects was happened after this war students a merge of Punjab in the British Empire see the Sikh opposed their attempts by the British to rule Punjab directly but still the opposition were actually led by many important kings let's see who are that kings the Chattar Singh of Attariwala in Lahore he also opposed it the second thing was Mulraj in Multan it's the places from the Pakistan in the current Pakistan you can see that is that is a, that are the places who are there in current Pakistan they opposed that the rule of Punjab directly but still again the people of Punjab were defeated for this but still finally the Lord House Lord Dol Housey with his cunning policy of doctrine of lapse policy merged the state of Punjab with the British Empire this is how the finally the two 
Anglo-Sikh wars is ended and finally the British took the complete control over India and also to the Lahore places. So this is how your lesson will end students the extension of British rule in India. I want you to write the two important policies which has been used by the British and I want you to write the conditions of that two policies and I want you to explain in detail the three Anglo Maratha wars and the last but not the least the two Anglo Sikh wars the reasons and the effects I want you to write this the notes of this lesson will be shared in the next class through whatsapp or through google classroom app i want you to share all your homeworks through google classroom app signing off till then take care students stay safe stay home and keep your learning button on thank you so much